For New Jersey Advanced Media, I am Connor Hughes here at the Atlantic Health Training Facility where training camp practice number seven is officially in the books for the Jets. And with that, here are your three stars. The star number three, we're going to go with a guy who is pretty well known around the league, and that is Jets cornerback Darrell Rivas. Rivas made his return to the field for the Jets here in a full capacity for the first time all summer. He did individuals, he did one-on-ones, and he did every rep of the team drills with the first team defense. He also made a pretty nice play as well, a diving, lunging, pass deflection on a Geno Smith throw to Kenbrell Tompkins on a curl. So good to see number 24 back here on the Jets defense. Star number two, we're going to go with a guy who has had a relatively quiet camp to this point, and that's just seventh round pick Sharon Peak. That's expected. He's a young guy, seventh round pick, learning the position, adjusting to the NFL life. But today, we got a little bit of a glimpse of what he's capable of when he's on. Uh, Christian Hackenberg went deep to him down the sideline. Justin Burris had perfect coverage, and Sharon Peak really only had one option. Stuck out his one hand. The ball stuck to his hand like a like glue, and he pulled it in for the long gain. So for that, he is our number two star. And at star number one, we're going to go with a guy who's had a relatively off camp, but was way on today, and that's Jets quarterback Bryce Petty. The two plays that really stand out were his only two plays in the two-minute drill, and that's because on both plays, he threw touchdowns. The first one, perfect post route to Titus Davis, easy bang-bang play for the score. The second one dumped it off to Romar Morris, who raced 60 yards for the touchdown. So for that, Petty is our number one star. Aaron Florin Park with the Jets. I am Connor Hughes.